Brazil produced their best performance of the World Cup so far as they danced their way to a one-sided 4-1 victory against South Korea at the Stadium 3 at 974 in Doha. The five-time champions will now face the 2018 runners-up Croatia for a spot in the semi-finals. Well, Brazil got a major boost with their talismanic forward Neymar making a return to the starting eleven after recovering from an ankle injury. Real Madrid's Vinicius Junior set the tone of the match with a composed finish um, from Rafinha's cross in the seventh minute. Neymar got on the score sheet six minutes later. The PSG star converted from the spot after a foul on Richarlison. This was Neymar's 76th goal for Brazil and he's now just one shy of equaling the legendary Pelé for most goals scored for the country. Richarlison then added to his personal showreel of great goals at the World Cup when he slotted home after some brilliant individual skill and clever interplay with Thiago Silva. Brazil put the game to bed in the first half itself when they hit a helpless South Korea on the counter in the 36th minute. Attacking midfielder Lucas Paquita scored with a well-placed volley from a Vinicius assist. The Koreans, however, did score a late consolation goal, and what a good one it was, through Pak Sung Ho, but the damage was already done. Following the match, the Brazilians held up a banner giving tribute to 82-year-old Pele, who was hospitalized last week. First of all, I would like to thank God for the strength I have to be back on the pitch, to be able to train, and to be able to do everything I needed to do to be on the pitch again. I'm happy to have played well and now being called the man of the match is something somewhat difficult because everyone played very well. We needed to commend all the players and we are very happy with our performance. That's what we wanted. We wanted to move to the next round. We wanted to win and that's what we got. This is GS.